we were just talking there a while ago about the Claret Dabbler and, and the mixes with um, Tom and myself there. And this is uh, the Claret Dabbler we're going to start first of all. We're just going to tighten everything up there, pop it in the, in the, in the vice, and we start off with our tread. What hook are you on, Jeff? You're on the... I'm on the, the Fulham Mills medium. Yeah, medium. Yeah, medium. Yeah, 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 yeah. 15.50. Yeah, yeah. So we're just and you going go to, to size 10. I'm just going to go to size 10, Tom. So we're just going to run down the shelf. How many 12s and dabblers A few, Tom. Um, um, not as. Because I don't. Probably up no, this direction. You tie more. I'd be tying more. Around here. Yeah, yeah. It wouldn't be a massive. Usually, if someone wanted a. Wanted, we say, a kind of a, a 12. And I, I actually like tying uh, tying the, the short. character short. Short on a 10. On a 10. Yeah, fair enough, yeah. You know, yeah. it's it's a kind of an old traditional type yeah, thing. I yeah. think that went back from Lock Mass time, you know. Yeah. Moved up a bit though. Yeah, yeah. So, look, we're going to run that down the, down the, down towards the bend of the hook. And we're going to take... So pheasant tail. A little bit of pheasant tail. Usually Always pheasant tail or bronze so, mallard? Bronze mallard, pheasant tail. It's between it the two, It's really. between the two of them. It's between the two. Unless you're going for a, um, a really gearish one with a bit of a yeah. bling on the back. Yeah. So basically, I'm going to just snip it like that. Many fibers are there, Jackie. I didn't count. You want to count them? Oh, <laughs> Could you count them there, please? Uh, I think I need to change my glasses, Tom. Yeah. You know, but uh, look, there's there's about five there, Tom. Right. You know, so um, basically what I, I usually got do. It from you. you got it from me. <laughs> so ba basically what I do is I just kind of I just measure like that, Tom, and then I run it down the, the length of the the shank. The length of yeah. the shank, yeah. And I just run it down, and then a pinch and loop like that, and then run it back up again. And I'd like to get that kind of see the flare that's coming. Yeah, through it, yeah. You know, so. And we've not gone for. A tag or a, a button, no, I no, no, no. I think what, with that mix that we've done earlier on the last video, Tom, yeah. I think there's enough of a flash coming. You can see it there coming through. It's rich, uh, like, really nice. Yeah, it is you know, rich. Is it, a great it, way of oh, describing it. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, really, really rich. You know, it's funny. I was saying just when we we're putting it back together there. You know, sometimes, and you were saying Melvin and Mask. Like there are times on car where they don't want to see a bit of flash at all. No. And I'm just like, and I'm looking there at that the black claret one, yeah. and I'd probably be, I would definitely be tying that just on its own. Yeah. I'm with you totally. On mask, sometimes it's got to have a bit of a little, little bit of bling, bling, yeah, that, a little bit. As we say, bling yeah. in it, yeah, yeah. So I like, I like a red, tra tra red yeah. wire. Yeah, I'm with you. I think yeah. really, really, it really stands out, especially the yeah. with the claret. You really, know? with the claret sets yeah. off. Yeah, definitely. It does. can actually change the look of a fly completely. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, what impressed me so much with this dumb and Tom is just how easy I mixed it by hand in the yeah, last we video. Yeah, saw that. Yeah, yeah we mixed it. Yeah, and and it's two shades of claret. One is the it's the seals, it is the seal the seals substitute and the micro flash top. Absolutely. And, and just but I think when you said they're rich, yeah, rich. it is. You, you can see it there yeah. going on how rich it is, there, Tom. And this is going to really bling, as they say, yeah. out. You know, yeah. you can see it there. Look, it's just. Now, would there be times when you use the whole, let's say, micro flash top? Yeah. Yeah, you would, yeah. And just, rather, yeah, than, rather yeah. than, that's a more yeah, subtle look. Yeah, that's to me, it's just it's just a nice mix there coming through. It's you coming can see, well, yeah. Yeah, you can see, look at the pearl is coming yeah. through, the UV is coming through, and everything's, it, it's really, uh, it's going to be a real fish catcher, to be honest, I think, Tom, you know? And when we get the, the brush through that, Tom, it's going yeah. to, like, you can see it there, like, it's just, look. Class, isn't it? Yeah. It is actually. Yeah. Really is. You know, it's just standing out, Tom. So we're getting a, a Claret Hackle. This is actually Cock Cape. Cape. This yeah. is actually one of uh, my friend's capes. Tony O'Sullivan from oh, Cork. Is that, is that one Tony? Oh, that's Tony sent that yeah. up to me as yeah, a little Tony. present. Yep. You know, so. Just great colours. Great colours. Mm. Great fly tire. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you know, so I'm just going to put one small hackle down the body of a Tom because I'm going to brush this out. Right. You know, so get my little No, pliers. dabblers, do you do two turns first and go back? Or I'm just going to do one quick turn and one then I, turn. And I'm going to build the head up with, with a larger hackle just oh, to give right. that, okay, you know, that yeah, kick yeah. in the water, yeah. you know. So basically, I'm just going to go one and then at the body. Like that. And you can see, you can see it just starting to come through. It's yeah, I can see it peeking out almost, yeah, isn't it? Oh, oh, yeah, and I haven't even put the brush on it yet, yeah. Tom, you yeah. know, so. We're just going to catch it in. It's about four turns back of it. Yeah. 
So it's just going to catch it in again. And see the red coming through it, look to them? Yeah. And as we keep saying, super rich. Yeah. And then we're just going to catch the wire. Now we're just going to give this a little brush just to prove a point. Look at the, all the colours coming through the top. Yeah, wow. Well, that is that is fantastic. Yeah. You can see it. Yeah. To me, Melvin, Arrow, yeah. Mask. Anywhere. Anywhere, anywhere, you know? actually. And yeah, I mean, and they, yeah. Even Sheelan, you could tie that in an eight there for yeah. Sheelan. Yeah, because they like the bigger throat, don't they? Oh, they do. Bigger, yeah. bigger, bigger throat, bigger, bigger fly. And bigger belts. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just going to put a slightly larger hacker then at the head. Right. Of the yeah. How many turns do you put in those? Usually about two. Right. Just at the head. You know? Yeah. So again, a nice claret, one of Tony's. again like a, a lot of people are, you know they, they be asking you know about the different types of wings on Claret Dabblers Tom but I, I'll show you the way I like the time yeah I'm, I want to see the way you do it now because yeah. it's it, everybody Everyone's I won't say everybody's different but yeah. there, there are a number of styles and some people use one yeah. style other, yeah. other lads use a different style You can see it there, Tom. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Come at it from the other side. You, know, yeah. you can see, uh, oh, like, yeah. it's just yeah. everything, everything is just kicking off in it, Tom. The color, like you know. So everyone has their own opinion on dabblers, Tom. Uh, the way I like to tie mine, Tom. To be honest with you, I I hate, hate a sparse wing. Right. Yeah. I just don't like it, Tom. Yeah. And you know, and that's my thing on it. So I, what I always do, Tom, is get my bit of bronze mallard, just put it out like that, cut it, yeah. I just straighten it slightly, yeah, Tom, yeah. again, right, and I, I turn it. The, the, the vice over like that to get underneath it, right, and I just measure it. See that just to the the point. The point. Yeah, yeah. Right, and again pinch. It's almost like a beard hackle. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, and it's not running down over the, we say the 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 bend. Or yeah. The, you know. Catch it in. Just measure it up to the point. Yeah. Offer it up to the point, and then just pinch it loop and get it in. And you can see it just about, just yeah. see it just about coming through there. And to me, that's the way I like doing mine. Yeah. Too, you know, so I get a slightly larger bronze mallard again. People will probably say that I do mine. You know, just put it on the top. You can do it that way and just tighten down on it. But yeah, for me, that's the way I like doing mine, Tom. Well, they work. So. They work. <laughs> so again. Yeah, you straighten to line up the tips really. Just to line up the tips. Because if you don't tips. straighten, yeah. they come off. They no. come off very uneven yeah. on the hook. Yeah, absolutely. So, what I do like to do then is just like that. Sort right. So you you split it in put, half and place one over the, the other. other. Yeah. 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 And then line it all up, measure it. Yeah. So I like and, mine just uh, coming slightly over the, the bend of the hook. Yeah. If you were to take a straight line yeah, yeah, down from the yeah, tips there, yeah, it was just going beyond. Absolutely. Hook. So, so naturally on the top then it's going back way more. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So I just, again, it's just a small pinch. Now, the way I do this, I just lift it. Do you see the way it's just lifted yeah. here, Tom? So basically you've lifted yeah. the side of the feather up yeah. this side. Yeah, and I just right. one loose turn, two, yeah. three, and then start tightening, Tom. Right. So I'm left with that yeah. kick. So basically those couple of 
loose turns or just kind of holding it. You're just place. holding it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Because if you if you pinched and looped straight away, yeah, it would hold everything in, and that's yeah. it. But with this way, it's kind of like shrouded yeah. or cloaked over the top of it. Yeah, and you can see and you get that lovely effect with it. Yeah, that and that, that way, me. all the fibers from the side, each side, go up and absolutely. cover all the top the part top of, of it. it. Yeah. And that's what I like yeah, with my dabblers. Yeah. You know, that that's one thing I really like. Yeah. I hate this dabbler that's kind of, you know, I call it the, it's like the main shit. Everything is out of place. It's yeah. not, you <laughs> yeah. know, it's yeah. just, you know, to me it doesn't look right. Yeah. You know, so I'm just going to cut away my waist. Again. And most important, a very sharp scissors, Tom. Yeah. And I'm just taking it, see the way I'm taking it. I see the it, way you're I'm going in it, under it. Yeah, taking it at an angle just yeah. to clean up the head nicely. Going so under the, the, yeah. the bits that you've cut off, yeah. tie them up nicely. Yeah. And that also traps them in as well. Yeah. And that's my my fly tight. No. I have to take that one now, Jackie. That's no problem. Yeah, sorry. No, don't worry about it. I look after it well, but there's somebody who needs to see that. <laughs> Down in Carmona. That's no, okay. I, I'll, I'll, I'll have your address. I'll get it sent back to you. But don't I, worry. I think you can finish it off with. I like using super glue, Tom. Yeah, I use super glue as well. Yeah, I like yeah. finish off the super glue. Yeah. So we'll move on to the next one, Tom. Excellent. Well, yeah. um, don't worry about that fly. That'll be grand. That's all right. Come here, actually. Do you know what we might do? We do a quick tabler with the straggle. Yes, okay. we'll do that. One yeah. Next. So we'll do another claret tabler. Yeah, and we can do it. Yeah, excellent. Yeah, yeah. perfect. Okay.